What's going on guys? It's your boy Angry SA Gamer and um, I was faffing around on Malacrox's account trying to build a stealth um, What's his name again? A stealth Sasquatch and um, So Challenge Warden is on and I thought to myself, what would it look like? If you were to put stealth team against the Warden Now I've got no idea but let's see what this warden does. Deals damage to an enemy heroes, to all enemy heroes, and silences them. So that's a problem, the silence, right? When attacked, warden raises its attack and cannot receive more than 60,000 damage per hit. Warden has high dodge and is immune to freeze, petrify, silence, stun, fear, and energy reduction. So basically anything that your hero can dish out, he is immune to it. So, well, a stealth team should do something then. So I have the Lazulix, the Lava, and the Ronin, all with 9 of 9 stealth. Then I have Rosaline, Ashura, and Serena, all with 9 of 9 Sacred Light, but they have stealth um, insignias. Rosaline has 8 stealth, Ashura and Serena both have 4 stealth. And Ashura, ach, um, Lazulix, no. Yeah, Lazulix, Levanica, and Ronin, both, um, all three of them have level 8 um, survival insignia. I keep blanking out on that stupid insignia. Um, so, the stealth insignia does 4.5 stealth, second stealth, doesn't matter how high it is, it's just the attack and attack speed and stuff that changes. So let us go against this Warden and see what happens. I'm no expert in Warden. I've never been and I never will be. But I'm guessing I'm going to start with Levanica. Oops. Didn't really drop. I don't expect them to lose a lot of HP on level 1. Because if they do... I really need to change this um, challenge, obviously. Okay, um, this is probably where it gets a bit... Oh, damn, I messed that up. This is probably where it gets a bit difficult, isn't it? From what I've seen the other guys on YouTube done, I've seen this one. From here on out, it gets difficult. To about level 30 and 40, that's where nobody succeeds. From my knowledge, you know. I make it past one and two and three, never, never make it. My setup's completely wrong. I don't know what euros to choose because um, I'm a noob. Okay, but so far so good. That is what you would expect from level one and two. Now, is this now level three or is it level two? I don't know, but this is the third time I'm going. So I'm guessing level three. So let's see how bad they would fare from here on out. Hopefully we make it all the way past level 4, which I doubt severely. Because I have i don't know of people who make it past level 4. Or, well, I don't look. Because it, 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 I don't care. Honestly, I really don't care. This game mode, I find this game mode extremely stupid because um, it's only for pay to play. You, as a free-to-play player, you have to be so freaking strong to be able to get past the first one. And generally you do, because the first one is so easy. But the second, third, fourth, you, second one, I don't even know if free-to-play will make a second one. Um, what is, uh, especially against the Oracle, because he entangles you and you don't move. You, you gotta wish your way through that one. So we killed this one in a little over a minute. One minute and f six seconds. So this now we are now we are on level three. So how come I've this is the fourth time I'm going, but I'm only doing level three. This doesn't make sense to me. I'm confused. I don't know how this works. Hmm. Did they maybe change this challenge to where it's a bit easier? And do you need a pumpkin duke to be... Because it's going a bit slow. 
Serena, don't you even dare to die, please. Well, the, I, I think the point is for them to lose some health because we want to see them go into stealth mode. Because at the moment, they're not putting out any damage. Because they're only putting out the da amount of damage that their skill allows because they aren't below 30% HP. That's only when they, uh, they get a buff in damage and attack speed as well. And then the survival insignia only benefits them health as far as I know. There's no attack benefit. We have made it a quarter and we're a minute in. This could be trouble, boys. I don't know if we're going to make it because we don't have a hell of a lot of gems on this account. But if we don't die, is that when we can go for free? But if we don't make it, we also got to pay, I believe. Azulix is up again. I don't know how he died. That's weird that he died. He's not even the focus legend. Levanica is. And Ronan is out. Okay, even with the stealth talent and the survival insignia, they still die. And Lazulix about to die. There he goes. This is the furthest, furthest I've made made it into the Warden Challenge. I've never make, made it this far. So I'm pretty proud of myself. Are we going to make it? I doubt that. Ronan is out completely. Which is kind of disappointing. Because he's the one that's supposed to be stealth for the longest. I mean, he's not supposed to die. So with this happening now... I doubt that we are going to make it through the next one. I don't think so. But we're not doing that badly for a team that is as a talent that does not benefit them unless they're under 30 HP. And um, for a insignia that's not going to benefit them a whole lot in here because as you can see we we'll already lost two legends. So we did not make it. Can, can you use PD in here? That's a failure. We can buy a chance for 350 gems. Mm, can, can we get PD in? I don't know if PD is available. Uh, probably not because I don't see him. No, then PD is not available. I wonder, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Sorry, Malacrox. You only have 500 gems, and I just spent 350 of those gems on Challenger Warden. Okay, but I wanna see if we can get anywhere with the next Warden, because that's. Ronan's already dead. How? Ronan, how the hell did you die? Okay. Level 40. Would, would this be possible, boys? I don't know. Serena died already? Well, we minus a legend, and any legend that dies now would for sure be dead. No way to awaken them now. Where's the new Fortnite reboot bus if you need one? Levanica died? Out of all these legends? Hmm? And we, I, I don't see stealth mode kicking in. Ronan is out. Stealth? Okay, so that's it, boys. Listen. Stealth mode for Challenger Warden? No way. It's not going to happen. It's the dumbest thing I've ever done in my entire life. Well, well. What a failure. What, what did you expect? Hey, sitting there in uh, expectation? Stop it. Stop sitting there in expectation because this is useless. Form a team? Form what team? No, 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 no. No, no, no.
challenge again oh my gosh i don't know how they got through well guys there you have it this stealth team is not worth it and it is so disappointing i wish they can buff buff <clears throat> i wish they can buff the alphabet make it the cooldown less three seconds something like that because otherwise the stealth talent i feel it's useless unless you have unless you have this one look at this look at this boys what a sexy beast level 30 breakthrough dove keeper with nine of nine stealth completely maxed to the brim let's see if she is maxed to the brim completely equipment there we go bam traits bada bing bada boom she's not maxed malacrox you are slacking my boy you are slacking you are slacking Nine hundred and eighty thousand. She's got over a million HP. Breakthrough level thirty dove with nine and nine stealth. This is probably probably the strongest legend in the game at the moment. Well, guys, I'll see you in the Sasquatch video coming up next. Cheers.